We concluded the previous video by seeing two possible options for a hydrocarbon with four carbon atoms. It could be this chain or maybe this one. In this video, we will cover the concept of branches and rings of hydrocarbons. Let's discuss them in detail. We know how straight chained hydrocarbons are. One long straight chain of all the carbon atoms. Many hydrocarbons with less number of carbon atoms are almost always straight chained. However, as the number of carbon atoms in the compound increases, the bonding of carbon atoms with each other could change a bit. To understand this, let's take a simple example of a hydrocarbon with 6 carbon atoms. For now, let's not look into whether it's an alkane, alkene or alkyne. Let's just focus on the number of carbon atoms. Now, tell me how will the chain be arranged? Like this? Yes, it can be arranged like this. But can't I arrange it like this as well? Of course you can. Because in this structure too, we have 6 carbon atoms. This carbon atom on top can be shown bonded to any other carbon atom as well, right? Now one more possibility from a different perspective. Can we just join the chain and form the structure like this? Yes, and this structure is also correct. In all these structures, we can later fill the remaining slots with hydrogen. Coming back to these structures, as we discussed earlier, each structure is correct in its own way. The first one is the straight chain structure. The second one with other possibilities as well is what we call branched chain structure of hydrocarbons. In these cases, the carbon atoms get attached as side chains to other carbon atoms. The last type is that of complex compounds as they have carbon atoms in the form of rings. Such types are the examples of ring structures of hydrocarbons. They are also called cyclic hydrocarbons. All these three structures you saw here were of alkanes as there are only one single covalent bonds between the carbon atoms. What type of structure do you think will be shown by alkenes and alkynes? Let's answer this question in the next video.